I thought for the hell of it, I would uh, take the end off of here and see what was inside. Maybe, you know, what went bad or, or why it went bad. So this CDI that I put on this little four-wheeler quit working. I put another one on here and it works again. And uh, I thought for the hell of it, I would uh, take the end off of here and see what was inside. Maybe, you know, what went bad or, or why it went bad. So I pulled this cap off of here and it's full of sand. And rocks, apparently. Like this thing is literally full of sand and rocks. I mean the sand is somewhat dry-ish. No, not really. I don't know. Well, since this thing's crap, maybe I can get this out of here. Let me put this down here for a second. If you can see that there, there's more rocks inside the black stuff here. And if you can look right there, that stuff's all corroded because sand was in there in the end and it got wet. You can see there's rocks all the way through it. So the moisture was able to get in here. So that's all the bigger the circuit board is right here.
this rocks and whatever this epoxy is. The majority of this board looks pretty good except for this end here where the sand was sitting and it was able to get wet and corrode. So that's not exactly what I expected to find when I pulled the cap off the CDI box, the sand or the rocks. But uh, yeah, maybe don't buy the Chinese CDI boxes. We got a mold. So it's just a short video. I thought it'd be interesting to see what the heck was in there, and it's definitely not what I thought would be in there. So if you like this video, give it the thumbs up. Don't forget to click subscribe. Thanks for watching.